Hello and welcome, I am Garen Reaver, also known as Garen, and today I'm playing Onitama against Ollie. Oh. This is a chess-like Japanese board game where you have five pieces which move in a variety of ways depending on tiles that you draw randomly from this bag. So first of all, we'll flip coins to determine who goes first, if you want to call it. Uh, I'll go tails. Heads, so I am get the first move. We draw two tiles each and one from the middle. So I have the crane and the fox. I have the tiger and the bear. And the one in the middle is the elephant. So I will open with the fox and move my master to there. So he can move anywhere as signified by the, uh, the coloured squares. And then I take the one that is in the middle already. Let me think. I'm going to go for the way of the bear and move my student forward like so. Okay. Uh, so the bear and the crane are the only two forward moving ones in this. Oh, wait, you can hop forward with the tiger. The tiger has a forward jump, but it doesn't work directly forwards. That's scary. Okay. All right, I think I will use the elephant. I'm not going to do that. Definitely not going to do that. I just realized that would have lost me the game. <laughs> I will use the crane to move forward one and take the bear. You win the game by taking the other player's master, or sensei, whatever you want to call it, or by moving one of your pieces into the other player's temple. I am going to go by the way of the tiger and, and move my Ooh. student there. Pressure. Check, because you can use fox. I'm going to use elephant to take your student. Yeah, that was a bit... didn't think that through. Um... Could this be the first game I win? Early cockiness from taking a single piece, Garen. <laughs> <laughs> I'll use the fox and move my student like that. Okay. I'm going to pretend that I <laughs> meant to do that, okay. and that it was actually trying to get your master out of the way. Yeah, good move. I'm going to use the tiger to take him. Oh, bloody hell. And then I get the fox. This is the best game I've ever played, by the way. Ollie's much better than me at this. It shows, clearly. I'm going to move to the side of the elephant okay. with my sensei. Alright, I will use the fox to move there. Check. It's not check. It's, it's, it's not chess. But, you know, it's a sort of courtesy, I can win next turn. Son of a bitch. <laughs> in two different ways, in fact. Yeah, no, there's... I, I, can't, I can't see a way to stop that. Have I actually won my first game? Yeah, no, I think you've won. Uh, let's go. I go around. Aha! <laughs> you have evaded my trap. However... <laughs> I will bear my way into your temple. That sounds wrong. Um, uh, don't look too deep into it. Onitama! I don't know if that's what they say. Game is yours. That is the first game of Onitama I've ever won. We've played quite a bit. This is the first time I've ever won. I'm very pleased. Let's have another game. This shouldn't annoy me quite as much as it did. <laughs> Alright, so this time you can go first. So you draw your two. Uh, the mouse, we go. the horse, the tanuki from the expansion apparently, and the dog, and the neutral is the ox. Ah, the inverse of the horse. It, as in real life. <laughs> yeah, you just, if you turn it, everybody knows if you turn a horse inside out, then it's an ox. <laughs> Three, uh, sorry, four out of five of the tiles are forward moving ones. Yeah. I'm going to go with the uh, the horse, was that? No, the mouse. the mouse. And I'm going to sensei forward. Okay. Well, I see you're going for the aggressive sensei gambit again. It almost always goes well. We have no, like, hopping ones, so this is going to be a lot slower. 
Yeah, the only one that pops is the Tanuki, and that's yeah. that's a diagonal, so it's... Okay, I will use the Tanuki to move my sensei forward as well. Hello, fellow senseis. And you know what I say to that? I... Now respectfully. We'll use the the horse and move forward my student. Mm, okay. Wait, ah. Wrong. Wrong student. That's student. <laughs> it worries me. That's uh, what I, I get see. for not thinking yeah. about orientation of tiles. I'm with you now. Yep, that's why that student. Very sneaky. Very sneaky indeed. I will mouse to move across one. I use the ox to move my student forward because it's still hmm. a nice place to pressure you from. Yeah. So even if it doesn't, even if it doesn't have you in check, it still puts you into an awkward spot. All right. I will use the horse to move a student forward to face you. I'm going to go with the tanuki. And move him. Oh! Oh, I see. I see. I see. Mm. Okay. I will take him with the dog. Hey, buddy. Hey. How's it going? Pretty good. <laughs> Welcome back. Thanks. I'm gonna go with the horse and move my student forward. Oh damn, you were one off there, weren't you? Yeah, I was going to say that with the um, the horse, I was either moving in or taking your sensei. I didn't even notice that. I mean, I knew you were like one away from taking the sensei, but it didn't occur to me you could have taken the temple as well. I will use the ox to move forward, as I'm the one with the tanuki suit. I'm going to do the mouse and move and student forward. It's getting tense now. We're all within striking range, and we can't we're all, jump. We're all just moving forward. <laughs> you can currently strike that way and that way, but you can't strike there, but I can't get anyone there. This is... One of us is going to have to take that step forward and go into striking range. Mm. And it's just a question of who will be vulnerable depending on who currently who has first. which diagonal tile. Okay. I That's why I, I do like Onitama, because either it's a longer game, but it's a really tense one, yeah. or if it's a kind of a throwaway game <laughs> and it just goes goes like nothing. Yeah, alright. The horse to move my student forward. Uh, wait, will I do that? Yes, I will do that. Go with the ox and move him forward. I am the master of moving left. Yeah, you are. You have nothing to move right. I can use that to my advantage, he says, with no way to use it to his advantage. Because <laughs> I'm the, the master of moving forwards and right. Mm. <laughs> or backwards and left. I'm just going to have to start taking some gambles. So I'm going to use the mouse. Holding on to that bloody tanuki. I'll use the horse. Yeah. I don't really know what piece. I was thinking. I really don't know what to do here. There is only one thing I can do, really, I think. And that's use the ox to move him up to there. Because if you want to take him, you're going to have to give up your dog. Mm. The problem is, I can't get round on the side I need to get down in order to use the tanuki. We're, we're almost perfectly mirrored. I just realised that. Yeah, it's only the sensei. <laughs> I'm going to use the mouse. I'm going to move my student there. Okay. That's interesting. I'm going to use the horse to move there. And I'm going to use the ox to move there. <laughs> this is such a, like, such a weird game. We're just mm. wibbling around each other. We're not doing Dancing anything. Dancing around. Dancey, dancey, dance. Just get in there and land a kick, for God's sake. I'm going to use the mouse to move him to there. I'm going to use the dog to move him there. Oh, you used the dog. Mm. That was unusual. I don't know why you used the dog. 
guess I'll use the ox. Oh, yeah, I've got to actually move something, haven't I? To get the dog. Check. Nope. I can still hmm? take him there. Oh, yeah, you know, you're right. Ah, uh, don't do that. Hmm. Okay. See, now I hold the two power moves. Feels like the dog has really come forward as a power move. And the Tanuki mm. is useful, but I think because of the orientation of our pieces, it just isn't coming into play. I think I'm better off sacrificing the dog to take, take that piece. another piece. The dog is a very powerful move in this, but removing one of your pieces that's threatening my temple is more important. Because I don't see any way you can use it immediately. Mouse to move back a bit. I'm going to use the horse to move there. I'm going to use the mouse. And move her there. Ooh. Oh, that was a good move. Mm. Uh, ox. Let's move there. Damn. Did I just lose? I think you might have. I'm going to move him there. I think I'm safe. You're one away now, aren't you? Yeah, and I can get there with the dog. I think I, think I might have got it. I think you might, yeah. I thought you were going to take my piece with the dog and then you'd be in the no. centre of the board miles away and you could move forward that's what oh, I was going to say I can, I, I, can see, I can see the tanuki there I am not, I'm not falling into that trap oh sh yeah no I, I didn't see that yeah I keep thinking the tanuki is hopped sideways it's not it's hopped forward and sideways mm. yeah I think you've got it there I don't think there's anything I can do because you can dog past my student mm. Right. Mm -hmm. Yep, you got that one. May have taken the more pieces, but it was the, it yep. was the, it was the. I, that dog. I got the temple. That's the. <laughs> you got the temple. That's all that matters. It doesn't matter what I said. It's the, I got the temple. Yep. Well done. Good game. Mm. And that was a prop, a proper game of only time. That yeah. was. Yeah. That was really tense. So that was Only Tama. Thank you very much for watching. If you would like to see more, let us know. If you have any suggestions for other games we can play, put them in the comments as well as like advice for how we can play better. And uh, if there is an official version of Only Tama, please do let me know. So thank you very much, Ollie. Thank you very much as well, Garen. And we will catch you later.